Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, my name is Krista and I am so excited that you are here. Today's video is a BoxyCharm and Ipsy unboxing for the month of January. I am super excited to get all this stuff unboxed, put it on my face. I'm meshing them both together this time. I did get Ipsy this month. I have had it before, but I've been pausing my membership and just kind of forgot this month. So I'm gonna include that in my normal BoxyCharm unboxing. So if you'd like to see what I got in January's BoxyCharm and Ipsy, then just keep watching. So for this video, I am going to unbox my items, first BoxyCharm and then Ipsy, and then I'm going to do a quickie tutorial style video where um, I do kind of a little bit of a voiceover um, and I run through the products that I got only and then how the final look looks. So here is my BoxyCharm. The first product that I want to use is skincare. We received the Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mask in our Boxy Charm this month. The theme is Boxy and Chill, and this retails for $24. So that's great. I am going to put on one of these right now. Ooh, it's like a citrusy smell. Nice. Okay, so it's kind of like milky in there. It's wet. Oh jeez, it's dripping. Ugh. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so I'm supposed to leave this on for 15 minutes and then I'm gonna massage the leftover onto my skin. All right guys, so I have had this on for about 15 minutes. I got 10 seconds left. So, it's very wet, it's very wet, so be careful. There's my timer. Supposed to rub that in. Looks pretty plump. Pores look pretty small. Okay, okay. The next item that we got is this Brio Geo Rosarco Milk Reparative Leave In Conditioning Spray. The conditioning spray retails for $12. I'm excited to use this. I don't actually have a leave-in conditioner spray that I like right now. Um, I don't like things that weigh down my hair, so I'll give this a try and let you guys know. The next product that we got is this Ofra Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick in Miami Fever. It is such a nice like terracotta color. And I have never tried an Ofra lip before, so I'm really excited to try this out today. I think that is so pretty. I think it's gonna be really nice with like a brown look. So I'm excited about that. This Ofra liquid lipstick retails for $20. The next item is this Tarte Limited Edition Rainforest of the Sea Highlighting Eyeshadow Palette, Volume 3 and um, it's supposed to be like super shimmery on the inside, so very pretty. You do have a matte shade here. Two darkers, couple of golds, a little more silver color, pinky color, very pretty. Here are the swatches. Very pretty. Super excited to use this, and this retails for $36. The last product we got in our Ipsy is this Billion Dollar Brows Universal Brow Pencil. 
it has a spoolie on one end and then it is a nice thin pencil on this side. It is a nice brownish color. This retails for $18, so we will definitely give this a try. So the total for this box is $110. I am so excited and I cannot wait to try these products. So now let's go over what I got in my Ipsy. So in my Ipsy, I got this really cute little brush. It's got a sparkly handle, colorful bristles, so cute. The other part that's so fun about Ipsy is the little bag that you get. It, it, this one is just really cute. It's got this pink little ribbon for the little zipper handle. So adorable. Ipsy is $10 a month versus the BoxyCharm is $21 a month. And I did give, we got like a face polish mask in here, just like a little sample. And so I gave that to my mom. But we also got this Char Amazonian Clay 12 hour foundation sample. So I am gonna try this out today. And then I also got um, from the Balm a blush shadow. And this is in the shade Alternative Rock Volume 2. And it's a really pretty little color. So we will definitely be using this today. And then I also received a lip gloss from Fluid. So we'll try that out as well. All right guys, let's get into the tutorial. All right, after that face mask, I primed my face and I'm gonna go in with the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 hour full coverage foundation. It's kind of moussey. Ooh, it's a little dark. Just a little dark, look at my hand. It's okay, we'll put some concealer on. It's pretty nice as far as coverage goes. I think you can still see my skin, but it's nice. You're probably supposed to use a brush, but I like to use a beauty blender. So I concealed, set, and bronzed my face. I am going to go in with this Alternative Rock Blush from The Balm. I'm gonna go in with my Sigma F40. Ooh, lots of pigment. Ooh. My kind of color, you guys. Pretty natural. Let's see how it blends out. Pretty. All right, we're gonna move on to brows. I'm gonna be using that universal brow pencil from Billion Dollar Brows. Very creamy. It's not a horrible color. All right, my brows are done. I'm gonna go in with the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Volume 3 palette. The first thing I'm gonna do is go in with my Morphe M532 and Tiki, which is the shade here and I'm gonna put that in my crease. And then with my Morphe M573, I'm gonna go in with Malibu, and I'm gonna put that on my outer corner. And I'm gonna lightly bring it in. Then just with my finger, I'm gonna be taking Jewel, and I'm gonna put that on the center of my lid. And then I'm gonna go ahead and with that M573 and blend that. Then with this BH Cosmetics Flat Shader Brush, I'm gonna be taking Compass and I'm gonna put that on the inner corner and brow bone. For the lower lash line, I'm gonna take my BH Cosmetics brush in that first shade, Tiki. And I'm gonna run that under my eyes. And then I'm gonna go in with an E18 in the Malibu shade. And I'm gonna also put that under my eyes. And then I'm gonna blend that out really quick. The eyeshadows are subtle. I didn't wet them, so they could be a little bit better when they're wet. I am gonna use this same compass shade as my highlight shade with my Morphe M510. That's pretty.
yeah that's pretty highlighter all right i threw on a lip liner and i'm gonna go in with the ofra long lasting liquid lipstick in miami fever nice formula kind of like a whipped formula a little bit of a transfer so it's not like um, a super matte kind of lip it does come off on your hand doesn't dry down very pretty though I like the color I would like it with a much warmer eye I don't think I would normally wear this color with this eye look but I do love the color and then I'm gonna put on a little bit of this fluid lip gloss okay guys so this is the final look using january's ipsy and boxy charm subscriptions i think it turned out so pretty i love the highlight from the eyeshadow palette as a highlighter gorgeous and I think the eyeshadow turned out pretty. I do want to try these shadows wet and see if they're a little bit more pigmented, but I don't mind a softer look. And I really like the lipstick as well. The foundation is okay. I'll have to see how it goes throughout the day, and I'll let you guys know in the description box below if I liked it or not. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I hope you guys have a great day or night wherever you are. Toddy buys.